Hey guys, Moshe the Electric Israeli is here and thank you for joining. And as the Tesla Model Y is being delivered, uh, the biggest news uh, to me is the fact that the Tesla Model Y will have a heat pump and it will be the first Tesla that will have a heat pump. And why is it a big deal is because it will improve on real world range dramatically and it will make uh, the Model Y, the most efficient Tesla uh, in the Tesla lineup. And I'm going to expand about he, uh, real world miles in a minute. But this diagram shows you how heat pumps in a car work. So the heat is absorbed from the atmosphere and then the heat is compressed and turned into heating. And then heat heats cold air in the cabin and raises the temperature. He, heated uh, air is blowing into the cabin and decompressed heat turns into low temperature uh, heat if you want to cool the uh, the cabin. So uh, the, the, what Tesla cars had before and many other cars have it is what's called resistive heating. It's basically, uh, think about uh, a space heater that you plug into the uh, wall and 100% of the electricity that come in basically uh, 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 heats the, the space around it and it's 100% it's efficient. But the problem with it in an electric car that it uses tremendous amount of battery, goes straight from the battery power. This with a heat pump, it's uh, uh, basically an override almost and it works a lot more independently and it produces tremendous heat it hits the cabin very quickly. My, my Nissan Leaf used to have a heat pump and, 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 and you can see the difference. It, it is tremendous difference. And then uh, the effect basically is on real world range. Um, uh, Tesla cars as of now, my Tesla Model 3 would lose 30 to 50% in cold weather uh, driving. That is, that's a big deal. 30 to 50% in cold weather. Now, uh, I can tell you from my experience with the Nissan Leaf, uh, the real world range was very much similar to the um, to the rated range that you saw. Uh, now it's always good to preheat the car uh, before you drive it once once while it's plugged. But I can tell you that the heat pump is going to be tremendous, tremendous uh, help into uh, Tesla Model Y owners who live in cold states, which will make the Tesla real world range, Tesla Model Y real world range by far more superior. Now, of course we have to test it and we I, and I will when, once, once we have it, but I can tell you right off the bat that Tesla cars that are efficient already and that can give you a great real world range and great battery technology now with the heat pump will make Tesla Model Y the best Tesla in my opinion. Okay guys, looking forward, thank you for watching, see you tomorrow.